It is a WXI 12 first warning weather impact day. A line of strong storms moving through the Piedmont Triad earlier today, bringing wind and rain. We have live team coverage at this hour of the weather. Leanne Denier joining us from Greensboro with a look at the damage there. But we begin the four o'clock hour with meteorologist Jacqueline Shear with the latest forecast. Jacqueline, the latest timing and track as of now. Yeah, we're starting to see some of that severe impact wind down, but it's not quite over yet. And that's something, of course, you need to keep in mind. Here's a look at all of that heavy rain that we had throughout the last couple of hours, and that's the line of storms that actually brought some tornado warnings in with it. Now, as we're looking, oops, let me get that. There we go. We're looking near Raleigh at this point where they still have some heavy rain totals, yellows, oranges and reds there on your screen, but things are starting to lighten up. And now as we're heading towards our area, we're seeing some drier skies. Unfortunately, what we're also seeing is some sunny skies, and that means that these storms that are still coming through, they're scattered. They're not nearly as widespread. The rain's not nearly as heavy, but they have the potential to become strong to severe storms because of that extra energy and extra instability in the atmosphere. So we still have a severe storm risk. This one's new as we've gone through the past couple of hours. We've gotten an update on this, a marginal threat for most of the Piedmont. That's a one out of five on the severe weather scale. Most of us were under this yellow two out of five. Now some of our eastern spots, we've got eastern Randolph County that's still included in this, and we've got some of our eastern spots that are still included in that two out of five, but the risk is dropping here. As we're looking at tornado probability, that's still a probability for us as we're heading through the next couple of hours, a possibility, I should say, as we head through the next couple of hours and we start to see some of those storms pop up, become strong to severe, and damaging winds are also a possibility, although that risk is now moving to the east as well. And I'll tell you, the mountains and most of the foothills, any storms you get, they might be strong, but not likely severe. Let's talk about that rain though too. It was a lot. Here's a look at our rainfall totals from today. We've got a quarter of an inch in Winston-Salem. We've got over an inch and a half in Boone, three quarters of an inch in Ashboro, some heavy downpours out there. We're going to talk about when we could see those last couple storms, the severity they could have behind them, and then the differences we'll be seeing by tomorrow. That's coming up. 